Happening right now, students at Baldwin High School are holding a unique overnight vigil to spread awareness about certain types of violence. Jessica Guay spoke with the students behind the initiative. What's happening here behind me at Baldwin High School, students are reading more than 8,000 names of victims of school place and identity-based violence for 24 hours straight. Matthew Ketcher. One name at a time. Daniel Mauser. Students at Baldwin High School are remembering people who lost their lives to violence. We are reading the names of 8,339 people from North America who were murdered because of the group with which they were identified, whether that be their race, their gender, their orientation, their ability level, their religion, and we're also including 500 some that were killed in school place violence. Spreading awareness about school place and identity based violence is important to the students who are part of the school's light education initiative. But I think the most important thing is to kind of recognize that we are all human. It's these things about being disabled, about being a person of color, about being gay or in the LGBTQ plus community. These are things that you cannot necessarily change. So it's just aspects of people trying to live their lives and be who they are. Um, and I think everyone deserves to be able to do that. The vigil started at 8 a.m. Friday and will continue until 8 a.m. Saturday. Students are taking turns reading names, which can be taxing. Through this vigil, we are not letting the people that lost their lives because of the hatred of others, we're not letting them be forgotten and we're honoring their memory. Teacher Daniel Shaner says the list includes the 11 lives lost in the Tree of Life shooting in Pittsburgh and the six people killed at a Nashville elementary school on Monday. This week has been difficult for teachers and students. Multiple schools in Western PA receive fake reports of active shooters. Shaner says their 24 hour event teaches students that every life has value. I hope that one day we don't have to do this anymore. We the, my goal would be a year where I don't have to make any new slides for our PowerPoints. Reporting from Baldwin High School, Jessica Gway, KDKA TV News.